The Senator from Arkansas. I speak today in support of the nomination of Dominic Lanza to be a district judge for the District of Arizona. Dominic is my old friend and law school classmate, and maybe most importantly, intramural basketball teammate. When he was known as Dom, or perhaps the Dominator. Now, I can't claim the credit for Dominic's nomination. He has the highest qualifications, and his whole life has prepared him for, a mo for this moment to be a United States District Judge. Dom graduated with highest honors from Dartmouth in 1998, where he was also an all Ivy League and academic All America offensive lineman on the Dartmouth football team. He received the Baird Award for being the outstanding graduate of his class in achievement, character, and leadership. In law school together, he excelled, graduating with honors, serving as a member of the Law Review. He went on to clerk for Judge Pam Reimer on the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals. For five years, he worked in private practice with Gibson, Dunn, and Crutcher in their constitutional and appellate law practice and won awards for his pro bono work. For the last 10 years, Dom has served the people of Arizona and the people of this country in the U.S. Attorney's Office for the District of Arizona. As an assistant U.S. Attorney, from 2008 to 2012, he prosecuted over 300 defendants for a wide variety of crimes, including immigration offenses, drug trafficking, and public corruption. He authored more than 20 appellate briefs and argued more than 11 cases in the Ninth Circuit Court of Appeals. From 2012 to 2015, he then serves as the Chief of the District's Financial Crimes and Public Integrity Section, and he now is the Chief and Executive Assistant U.S. Attorney, the number two position in the district, where he oversees the Phoenix office. Dom has said the most important thing he's learned from his time in the U.S. Attorney's Office is the need to represent the facts and the law fairly and accurately to the court and opposing counsel. He's also learned the necessity of treating everybody involved in the legal process, from judges to jurors, court staff, opposing counsel, and parties with courtesy, dignity, patience, and respect. Dom has volunteered in the Court Works Program in which students from at-risk schools can perform simulated trials, and he's participated in the Veterans Court Program, which provides increased support and guidance to federal criminal defendants who are veterans. Dom participated in, completed, and received the highest marks from Senator McCain and Senator Flake's Judicial Nomination Panel. He now has the support as well of Senator John Kyle. I commend all three men for an outstanding selection. As I said, I can't take credit for Dom's nomination, but I can perhaps add a little bit of perspective to the kind of judge he will be from the man I knew on the basketball courts. Dom was tough. If you were driving to the basket or fighting for a rebound, you did not want him in your way. Dom was fair-minded. If he fouled an opposing player or knocked the ball out of bounds, get no argument from him. He would admit that he had knocked it out of bounds or that he had committed the foul, and play would go on. Dom, I have to say, was even-tempered, something of a gentle giant. When tempers flared on the basketball courts in Hemingway, as they, in retrospect, did too often and over silly matters, Dom was a peacemaker, separating those who might otherwise be in an altercation. Dom was a team player. When it was time for him to take the shot, because that's what the team needed, that's what he would do. But he was just as happy to pass the ball off, to set a screen, to box out for a rebound. And Dom was good-natured. Competitive, to be sure, but he understood that in the grand scheme of things, we were just a bunch of washed-up high school and college athletes enjoying a few hours off from our studies. These are all traits that are going to put him in the best position possible to deliver justice not only for the people of Arizona, but for the people of the United States. Everyone who comes before him is fortunate that Dominic Lonzo will soon be a district judge. For 42 years, Dominic has been known as Dom or the Dominator. But in just a few hours, he will be known as your honor. 
Few men, by their character and by their lives, better deserve that title than the dominator, Dominic Lanza. Madam President, I yield the floor, and I note the absence of a quorum.